This month, thousands of high schoolers are graduating in North Dakota, and from there, the young men and women will figure out if they're headed for college or to a full-time job. As Bank of North Dakota's Rachel LaForce tells us, that decision will set up young people for their financial future. Hi, I'm Rachel LaForce. Congratulations to all the high school seniors in our viewing area. Today, we would like to discuss some financial tips as you enter the next phase of life. Whether going straight into the workforce, the military, or for more education, finances will play a role. Regardless of how much money you will make or have available, setting a budget is important. Figure out how much money you have available to spend every month. Make sure you set aside some in savings in case you have unexpected expenses. Figure out the ways you can cut expenses so you avoid spending too much. There are many choices to make that can cut expenses. Choosing to live at home, in an apartment or dorm with roommates, or living on your own all require a different level of funds. Whether you drive a new or reliable used car can affect the amount of money available. Choosing to work full-time or part-time will influence the funds you have available. This is an easy time to place too much on credit cards with plans to pay it off another day. When you carry a balance on your credit card, you start adding interest to the payments and it can make it more challenging to pay off. This may impact your credit rating in the future. Some jobs will look at credit ratings before employing you. A future landlord may also review it to make sure you are reliable to pay rent. These are just a couple examples of why it's important to make good financial decisions and start working on a good credit rating early. I'm Rachel LaForce with Bank of North Dakota. For more on money and other finance tips, just click on the KX Finance tab on kxnet.com.